What the for real? Like, what, what's going on? Starbucks? I, I don't God understand. And what a blessing every second is. Miss calls and messages. I miss the nights when you. What is up? <clears throat> what is up, my beautiful people? How is everybody doing today? Today is another B E A U. Beautiful day. But something just happened to me. Something very tragic. I don't know if I'll be able to tell you guys because I was really excited to eat my cereal. I looked at the carton on my milk and it said that it was gonna go bad in like five days. So I was like, cool, I got a ton of time. I just poured the milk and this happened. Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. What the hell is that? This came out. What the hell is that? I'm sorry if that was gross to a lot of you guys. It was really gross to me too, but I'm I'm more so just upset that I don't have milk and I poured cereal and then I just poured what seems to be snot onto my cereal and it now what am I gonna do for breakfast? I don't know. I would go get donuts, but Greece is in 30 days and I can't get donuts until after Greece probably. Or maybe they have really good Greece donuts in Greece. In Rome. How did you what is it silk? Is it silk? Is that silk? Is that what that is? All right, well, since we just went over that, we do this thing on the channel to where I want to know where you're from, how you found the videos, and then tell me what's the grossest thing that's happened to you when making cereal, or actually just any time. What is the grossest thing that's ever happened to you? Because when I poured that in that, like, dairy slug, just like, went, oh, that was really gross. I, I honestly was like, whoop, whoop, whoop. Hi, cleaning lady. All right, cool. Every time I say hi to someone, they just leave. So I figured out what I want to do right now. Um, I'm seeing this trend happening to where people are getting this thing called the unicorn frappuccino from Starbucks. So I'm like, hey, why, I, I don't drink Starbucks, so why not try out something from Starbucks? Does that make sense? No. So I'm gonna go try a unicorn Yay. frappuccino. Hopefully, I don't like coffee, so maybe, I don't know if it has coffee in it or anything, but let's go get a frappuccino from unicorn. Yay, wake up. Corn blood, is that what? Trust me, this is how it's gotta be. When I close my eyes, you're the one that I see Cause you only need the light when it's burning low Only miss the sun when it starts to snow Only know you Alright guys, so we are here We're here! I'm behind Mrs. Clur Thinking, I'm like, how do I even ask for this? Like, do they know? Like, do people ask for this? Do I be like, I want that unicorn Jay. drink? No, no, that probably wouldn't work Can I try that, uh, unicorn drink? You know what? We're, we're all out of it we're we're sold out. Oh dang. Do you know if like there's any more around anywhere? Um, not in this district that I'm aware of, to be honest with you. Um, uh, can I get the s in Swiss? The slow roasted ham in Swiss? Yeah. Of course. Anything else? No, that's it. Just the sandwich then, right? Yeah. You're telling me every Starbucks in the district <laughs> Shut up. Shut up, car. Is sold out of unicorn drinks. Starbucks, you're supposed to have these drinks. The drinks aren't supposed to be unicorns. You're, you're not, they're not supposed to be hard to find or like a, some mystical thing that you hear about. La, 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 la. Cool, thank you. Five dollars for a breakfast sandwich. This thing better be made of gold. So here's an update. Uh, I've been to four Starbucks so far. Uh, none of them have it. If it's not at this last one, I'm going to hunt down the CEO of Starbucks and I'm gonna dress him up like a unicorn and that's as far as I've gotten, but it's gonna get bad, all right? You guys have that unicorn drink? Have it? All out. All out, okay. What the f for real? Like, wh what's going on? Starbucks, I, I don't understand. I've been to five Starbucks within like, granted it was within probably two miles because there's a Starbucks pretty much on every corner of the street. But still, come on man. You can't be advertising unicorn drinks and then you need to put in small print. Actual unicorns may be impossible to find. Can you guys tell I'm triggered a little bit? Well, this was a fail. I guess I got my uh, title for the video. Unicorn Frappuccino Taste Test Fail. Good, cool, everyone click it. Oh, you already clicked it because you're here. All right, bye. But for real, if you guys want to stick around and watch the rest of the vlog, that, that'd be cool. I mean, if you guys are here, you might as well just watch the rest of the vlog and press that subscribe button. Welcome to the channel. We're, it's a fun channel, I promise. Trey and I are actually going to go get some haircuts today because our hair's getting a little long. That's why I keep wearing hats. Hi, Trey. Hey, Trey. Uh, you look upset. Yeah. 
I just went to like six Starbucks, sat through probably three drive through lines. None of them had it, Trey. Corn drink, I think it's an actual, actual unicorn. unicorn. How'd you know that? I watched your Snapchat. Oh, my Snapchat, shameless plug, if you're not following me on Snapchat. But to make us feel a little bit better, we're gonna go grab some haircuts, cause I need a haircut, so, oh God, so you guys had to see that, and then look at this man. Oh look my at this man. God, my head. Is that a bowl of top ramen? No, it's Trey's head. All right, so we just got our haircuts, finally. It's been how long since we got haircuts? Like seven weeks. Like seven weeks. I tried something a little different with mine. Not sure if I like it, but I think I do. You guys can tell me what you think. I just went higher with the taper. I still have to put like hair stuff in it. This has like nothing in it. But tell me what you guys think about it. Trey, you look handsome as always, man. Thanks, man. Yeah, everyone go follow Trey on Instagram, by the way. Oh my God. Day two. What is up, guys? It is Sunday morning. Tell the sneeze. Achoo. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, Trey, what's up, dude? <laughs> so if you guys haven't figured it out already, these uh, Monday vlogs are gonna be basically like weekend vlogs because I'm gonna just combine Saturday and Sunday or maybe I'll just do something epic on one of the days. Yeah, I, I feel like that's a great idea, don't you think so? Yeah. Oh, what were you asking me or the crowd? I don't know. I don't know anymore. I think it's a great idea. All right. Okay. So today we're gonna be lifting legs and arms because we always lift arms because uh what's that saying? The, what's that douchey saying? Curls get girls. Curls get girls. Oh well I was thinking more of like biceps and triceps. Naked make it triceratops. Right now. Alright, so we just finished up at the gym. Uh Trey just let out the gnarliest fart in the car. Yeah, I said it. I put you on blast like that, Wait, just like you put me on blast with your ass. Why did you frame me? You farted. No, don't, don't be doing that to me. No, don't, don't be, be doing, doing that to me. Don't be doing what you just You did. just farted, not me. But for real, that was disgusting. That wasn't me. You just oh, spit what? on my arm. You spit on my arm? You, Is that what's happening here? Bad. No, I'm tired of you farting in the car when it's 90 degrees. I, can't, I didn't fart. I can't you be farted. Having, I can't be having you shit. Farted. Can we take a poll down low? Who, who do you guys think farted, Trey or me? It was him. It was a backwoods Georgia fart. The That's innocent what it was. dude that happens to get his life filmed, or the narcissistic idiot. <laughs> cool. Good stuff. I'll see you guys at home. Stop, <laughs> hey, I'm trying to do my sneeze. Tell a sneeze. <laughs> Dang it! Did you? Oh. Trey keeps doing the tell a sneeze. Huh? He's not even here. Uh. All right, guys. Well, I gotta go to the fine bro shoot right now. I will see you guys in a little bit. Actually, I'll see you in like a second. But I just, uh, I ran out of things to say. Okay, bye. I really need better hair stuff. That's what, that's what time it is. All right, so I said I was gonna do a quick Q&A for uh, the end of today's vlog, because a lot of you guys have been asking for a Q&A, and uh, I figured I'd just put a little one in, uh, in the, 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 yeah, you get the idea. So I put it on Twitter and uh, Snapchat. So first question I'm gonna go, I'm gonna do a couple from Twitter, and then I'm gonna do uh, the rest from Snapchat. First one is from John Ree. He says, where's your merch? Guys, the merch is coming soon. If you guys want a t-shirt, be sure to comment down low, even if you're thinking, I'm not gonna comment right now. Guys, comment down low, because we're actually trying to get numbers on how much we should do, because we have some really cool designs that I can't wait to show you guys, which also is gonna be my tattoo, so it's gonna be really cool. So p please be sure to put in the description if, you're, if you would actually uh, get a t-shirt. Uh, Jen from Twitter says, when are you getting the tattoo? XOXOXO, XOXOXO, back to you. I'm gonna be getting the tattoo uh, really soon. Once we get the design for the merch done, uh, I'm gonna be getting that tattoo. And Tori from Twitter says, what's the most annoying thing that strangers say to you uh, besides how's the weather up there? Definitely, why aren't you in the NBA? Why aren't you in the NBA? Why aren't you in the NBA? Like me going to a short person and being like, why aren't you a professional mini golf player? Why aren't you a horse jockey? Like. B Cook 1237 says, if you can meet one famous actress and spend the day with them, who would it be and why? Also, I absolutely love you. No, I love you. Um, probably uh, Jennifer Lawrence for sure because she just seems so like down to earth and really funny and like me. If anyone knows J Law, tell her to hit me up. I'd like to take her on a date. 
Courtney1DHS says, Bo, please reply. I'm replying to you in this video, so hopefully you watch it. If you didn't, then you missed my reply. Scroll stop. BMAO46 says, what is your dream car? It is the Tesla Model S or the Model X. And I'm gonna do one more question. It's uh, from TTHRE13. Uh, they say, what are you gonna do after college? Is YouTube going to become your full-time job now that you are a rising YouTube celebrity? LOL, <laughs> I'm not a celebrity. Actually guys, YouTube is now my full-time gig. And it's all because of you guys. This is a great question to end it on because I just wanna tell you guys, I always tell you this, but I wanna just tell you how sincerely thankful I am for everything you guys have like given me. Like in your probably think I'm giving you what are you talking about just this opportunity to be able to reach out to you guys and eventually reach out to so many more people in the world and just as like we've all sort of helped each other as a community to just sort of feel better I really think in the near future we're gonna be able to do a lot of good things for a lot of different people in the world you guys are gonna hear more about that soon it's gonna sort of tie into the merchandise it's gonna it, it's it's you guys will learn about that more but I really think that this channel is gonna grow into something more and it's gonna it's I'm trying to think of how to word this. I think we can all do so much more to just help a lot more people in the world, if that makes sense. And I really think that we can do good things. And I can't wait to see where the future of Seven Foot Vlogs goes. I know that you guys will all be there with me. I'll be there with you. And it's only up from here, guys. And that, once again, thank you guys so much. And that's where I'm gonna end the vlog for today. Uh, I wish I could have found the unicorn drink. Maybe I'm gonna try it again, try to find it somewhere. But you know the drill, we got new videos every Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. Tomorrow I'm actually gonna be shooting some more Instagram skits with Matt Kutchel, and so that should be fun. So be looking out for those on Instagram, follow me on Instagram and all that stuff in the links below. I think that's it. But before we go, remember the most important thing, be you, be beautiful, because that's the best person you can be. Now go out there and live your life. Bob's living his.